What number am I? Let's review base 10. Each time we move up a place in a number, the digit is worth 10 times more. This one in the ones place is just worth one. But if we move it over to the left into the tens place, now it's worth 10. 10 is 10 times more than one. If we move over again into the hundreds place, now the one is worth 100, which is 10 times more than 10. If we move over into the thousands place, it's worth 1,000, which is 10 times 100. In the 10 thousands place, the one is worth 10,000, which is 10 times more than 1,000. And if we move over again to the left into the 100 thousands place, the one is worth 100,000, which is 10 times more than 10,000. This is why our number system is called a base 10 number system. We can use base 10 blocks to create numbers. Once we have 10 ones blocks, we can group them together to create a 10. Once we have 10 tens blocks, we can group them together to create a 100. Once we have 10 hundreds blocks, we can group them together to create a thousand. Ten groups of a thousand equals one group of 10,000. Ten groups of 10,000 equals one group of a hundred thousand. And 10 groups of 100,000 equals one group of a million. Let's play a game called What Number Am I? Here I have 1,000, 13 hundreds, five tens, and four ones. We can show this amount using base 10 blocks like this. But it's a little tricky to decide what number this is because I have so many hundreds. I can't put a 13 in the hundreds place. I have to regroup to figure out what number this is. I see 10 hundreds here. I know that 10 hundreds is really just another group of 1,000. So let's turn 10 hundreds into a thousand block. Now I have two thousands, three hundreds, five tens, and four ones, which is the number 2,354. Let's try another. This time I have one thousand, four hundreds, sixteen tens, and eight ones. I can't put a 16 in the tens place. I know I need to regroup or bundle 10 of those tens together to make another 100. Now I can see my number, 1,568. This time I have 1,000, 200s, 12 tens, and 17 ones. Let's start in the ones place. I can't put a 17 in the ones place of my number. There's another 10 hiding in those 17 ones. Let's take out 10 ones and group them together to create another 10. Now I have 13 tens and I can't put a 13 in the tens place. So I need to group or bundle 10 of the tens together to make another 100. This looks like it will work. I have 1,000. 337. This time I have two thousands, eleven hundreds, three tens, and fourteen ones. Let's start in the ones place again by bundling up ten ones to create a ten. The tens place looks okay. I can put a four in the tens place, but I have way too many hundreds. Let's turn ten hundreds into a thousand. Now I see that my number is 3,144. Let's look at an example without the blocks. I have five thousands, six hundreds, seventeen tens, and nine ones. 
I can tell that the 17 tens need to be regrouped. Let's take out 10 of those tens and turn it into another 100. So I had six hundreds, now I have another hundred, I have seven hundreds and only seven tens left. Now I can see the number 5,779. Here's another. This time I have three thousands, thirty one hundreds, two tens, and eight ones. I can't put a thirty one in the hundreds place. This time I have 30 hundreds that I need to turn into three more thousands. Each group of 10 hundreds is worth a thousand, and I have three groups of 10 hundreds, or 30 hundreds. So let's add three more to my thousands. I had three thousands, now I have six thousands. I got rid of 30 hundreds, that only leaves 100 left, and I can see my answer. 6,128. This time I have 12 thousands, 100, 10 tens, and six ones. Let's turn those 10 tens into another 100, leaving zero tens. And then 12 thousands, that's really a group of a, a group of 10,000 and only two thousands. So my number is 12,206. Here's one more. This is a tricky one. Let's start in the ones place. The ones look good. Okay, let's move to the tens place. I have 22 tens. 20 of those tens are really just two more hundreds. So now I have 16 hundreds and just two tens. Let's regroup 10 hundreds up into the thousands place. Now I have 10 thousands and just six hundreds. But 10 thousands, that's actually a group of 10,000. Now I can see my number, 10,622. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. Check the link in the description for lesson materials that go along with the video, and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.